I've met the leaders of all three raider gangs now. So, am I impressed? Disappointed. No, they pretty much fit what I expected and my expectations weren't that high. They are your typical group of murderers, cutthroats, mercenaries, slavers, and pillagers. Land pirates, basically. So nothing has changed my mind. I don't even care if you are less bad raider who has never done anything particularly evil. You are still part of a massive problem and will have to be dealt with. I can say for sure that the Disciples are the actual worst of all three gangs since they seem to revel in violence and just have a love for blood. Their leader, Nisha, is complete, or is it Nisha, is a complete psychopath. Their rule is just not to get caught, which means everything under the sun is okay to do, just don't get caught doing it. The leaders of the Operators are the second gang leaders I met, a sister and brother run crew, Mags and William Black. They seem like probably the least worst of the three gangs. They prize profit above all else, but will still slit your throat for a cap if it would be advantageous to them. In the middle for the worst of the three gangs would be the pack. At least they have a rule against harming their own. They supposedly exile offenders before killing them. But as for anyone outside of the gang, well, they are fair game. They seem to revere animals and their members often wear ridiculous animal-like costumes. Mason's their leader. Looks like a clown. I'd probably go for him last when I do take them out, since starting at Fiztop Mountain, the closest and worst of them all is the Disciples. Then the Operators are the closest after that, and then the Pack. See? I'm planning my route already. Now that I've met them, I plan on exploring and clearing out the parks, but not raising a flag to any of the gangs. When I'm done all that, I'll return and simply just start wasting their leaders and probably a huge amount of raiders inside their home base and on the way to the next one. When all is done, then Nuka World will be free, and I'll give the place back to the traders who were the original inhabitants and are now slaves for the raiders. I'm in no hurry. I have no baby Sean to save anymore. The Commonwealth was looking really stable when I left it, and Curie is with me, so I have a friend and lover who is at my side the whole time that and, well, I've agreed to have Gage follow along with us. Maybe he can help explain some things since he seems to know Nuka World a lot better than I do. Once I'm done here in Nuka World, I plan on returning to the Commonwealth and go and have a talk to Diamond City about the Minutemen. Then I'd like to go and see what the Brotherhood of Steel is still doing in our land, if they are still there, since the threat of the Institute has been removed. The raiders of this place are scum and their time is coming. Besides that, things are only looking good for my home and myself. So, why do I feel so uneasy about everything? All right. Well, it's early in the morning. I just traded a whole bunch of things, like uh, some uh, selling bullets and uh, old oh money for caps and more ammunition. And uh, put on the cappy glasses. How ridiculous is that? Anyways, I'm the overseer. No one should be able to say anything. So there's, what, ten places I have to go and look around? around the parks and I believe that there's one here in uh, was it Nukatown USA that's the uh, park that I'm in I think there's seven parks in total all I have to do is look it's, well okay lots of them around all I have to do is look and see what does it say uh, ten hidden Cappy images in the park. Each one has part of a code she needs to access the office of John Caleb Bradburton, the inventor of Nuka-Cola. Need to wear the Cappy sunglasses Sierra gave me in order to see the hidden Cappy codes. Okay, well, I will get ready to write this down. I wonder if it's not going to be like finding the railroad again. Excuse me, and yeah, Gage is with me. Porter, I guess I should be calling him. Understanding the operators ain't hard. We know how to live. I don't 
think I've guys? been in the Captain's Cafe. If you say so. Pretty sure this whole area of this park is secured, though. Unless you count the raider gangs. People just get upset that they ain't as cool. Sweet anyway, Zach Patsy, really Please, big just guy. leave me alone. I'll best, okay? Uh, I don't remember his name. Long way to see this place. Really? Overboss, you got that tough guy. Trouble. Just have a little fun, Ren. Uh, thanks? Get on his toes. I guess. I don't think you're a little rat's ass. Bye. Doing my best to keep up the mess. Not that I'm saying you're messy. Or any of the other raiders. Just get drink out. I'm under the table. It's hard for me to hear what you're saying when so much going on. A little off. Shut that radio up. I don't know what makes you think that. Hi. Never been much for conversation. I'm sure there's lots more interesting people to talk to around here than... Uh, I suppose so. Sure, we carry guns, but knives are where it's at. It's not fun unless you're up close and personal. Good luck. I hope it all works Raiders out. Mad Insane. William and Lizzie. All you have to do is hear them speak to know they weren't born into this life. They should have been if you say so. Yeah, I'd bring my kids here someday. Hello? Hi. Not for all the raiders. Play hard. That's the radio. So, what are you doing? What have you got? I got whatever liquor this rowdy bunch can get their hands on. From fine spirits to rock gut that'll put a fire in your belly. Hmm. I'll well, suit you. Sure. Let's take a look. Coming right up. Finally, he just goes... Dirty Wastelander. It's all warm. You really don't have much, but you know what? I will sell you some of my pre-war money for caps. Because I believe I will need caps to survive in here. And besides, this pre-war money is not really doing anything for me. How are you doing? Not looking for trouble, just some good deeds. That's good to know. Nuka Orange. Sweet. Which reminds me, I haven't had my Nuka breakfast. Ice cold Nuka Cola. Nuka side recipe? Bingo. Hey, hey, got some news for you all. Word's getting around that the overboss has been seen meeting up with the head honchos for each of the gangs. Talking about oh, me. Hi. Who it is? Always good to see the boss. Sounds like you're in a good mood. That's right. Why this We're taking back? the park. The whole damn thing. Don't shake your head at me. I'm Hell telling you, that's what's going down. You just wait. This new overboss is the real deal, man. Getting shit done. You have to hang the bodies in here, you sick bastards. You love job. it, and you know it. I feel kind of bad for these traders. Having to wear the collars like that. Mind your own business. Yeah, you guys are really messed up. Yeah, like I'd want to sit in the toilet with that hanging right next to it. Smells, everything smells like rotting death around these idiots. Sounds like a tough situation. That's, uh, enough. Let's go look for the uh, things around this park. I think that there's one. So I'm looking for a code. And start exploring the whole area, not just the parks, the entire area around the valley, I guess, because aren't we surrounded by mountains? You know. There's a whole valley, it's not just the parks. There's things outside there. Hubologist camp. If they're there, I can imagine there's more out there. I see a quantum. Oh. I remember the little TV on top of these. Stay hydrated with Nuka Cola. Nuka Dark, Cola. I'll just take this. I warm. I you know what? I should have brought what's his face with me, that. buddy. <laughs> Although I'd be really worry worried someone would steal him here. Possibly. Pack and disciples. Bunch of amateurs playing dress up. Sounds like typical raiders to me. You'd yep. all consider putting a bullet in Coulter's back at some point. Suppose you just beat us to it. Whatever you say, pal. Beat you to it, huh? You are here. Which is kind of useless because it doesn't really show the other parts. This was Fizz Top Mountain and then the little pond in front of it. And I guess 
this is the monorail? Oh, it shows the, uh, that's where I battled Coulter. Yeah, it should show all the parks. Not detailed enough. Nuka Arcade, we've been in there. Nisha really only has one rule around here. Don't get caught. That's don't interesting. Don't get caught, don't get caught. Do I even... What the heck? I... Okay. Maybe there is nothing here to find. I thought that there was. Alright then. Well, if that's it, you know what? Let's still start with these hubologists. I'm actually curious to see what it looks like between the parks. So we'll go south. Get out of this one. No, I was wrong. There is something here that Kidney. my pit boy is picking up. So I have the glasses on. Whatever it is, it should be right around here. Nisha really only has one rule around. Could be numbers, letters, both. Caught. That's promising. Ooh. Is that it? G. That's one. Uh, okay. Got a G here, writing down. Alright, let's return back to what I was going to do. Let's try to go to these hubologists. Nice and sunny. What's with the uh, vents? Some steam coming out of it. Alright, now I actually... This is the big-ass parkade area. I remember that. It doesn't look quite the same anymore. I used to go on for quite a distance. Okay, Hubologist. Uh, let me bring that up on the Pip Boy. Keep up the cappy things. Oh, 10 pieces of bloodworm meat. Gotta look for that. Who's Harvey? Uh, I don't even know. This way. Let's get this What's show that? on the road. It's a rat. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You got a hell of a survival instinct. Can't say that about many. Oh, the weather's really turned. I don't think I'm after rad rats. What the heck's a rad rat? Whoa, let's get one. on with it. Out of my way. You just got that thing customary. This one had bottle caps on it. Wash your hands after that. It can be unsanitary to handle the disease. I can't really say. I'm not certain. Somebody here? I offloaded all my junk into the overseer's trunk. <laughs> Up uh, Fist Top Mountain. Hopefully none of it will be taken. My pit boy is picking up some kind of warehouse there and there. To the south. Oh. This is nasty. Make our way out to the hibologists. Yeah, we looks like I'd have to go around anyway, so let's go south this way. Whatever's here, figure it out building over that way? Apparently I've been there. Oh, the pimple. Get him! Oh, we got giant ants. Sweet. There he goes again. Mysterious stranger. Lots of them. Got little ones falling along too. Yeah. Excellent. 
Oh, this one was the gun was not loaded. Really hard to hit. You're going now. Yeah, this place isn't as safe Is there as anything I else I should know? Dangerous. We ought to steer clear. I'll see what I can do. Call some boss. Hey boss. I don't know what this is. Nice. You are so. Uh, you are sweet. I'm sure, my weapons are fully loaded. Part of the nearby houses that were here. Maybe these are people that worked. Books. Maybe they worked in Nuka Town. Weird. I've never seen anything like this. Let's see what I can make out of that. Old bookstore. Oh, this is like a little town. Clock. Whatever you say. You're right about that. Yeah, they do talk. Restrictions. What? <laughs> oh, I remember that. I mean, see till the ride's complete. Nuka Racer, where I beat Coulter. That's how I became Overboss. Wow, your hair looks great. Just puts all this ammunition in there. I guess that's their storage trunk for whatever reason. Bakery candy. Love some freshly baked bread with butter. That is a real luxury these days. I don't think that there's anything here. Salon. A couple people. Either they spent their last moments sitting in these chairs or somebody put them there. <laughs> uh, cram is cram. Speaking of cram. Curious just saying being human agrees with her quite well. Uh, yeah. Speaking of that, uh, Cram, huh? I think they would have come up with a better name than that. It's a truly awful name. Thanks, lads. Snacks cake. Oh, yeah, well, it's just a bunch of homes and a few stores. That's it. I think I looked down this way, though. No ants, no rad rats. Okay. Well, back to where we were going, which was this place. 
Oh, this weather. Probably shouldn't have this gun. Let's see. This gun. Not very good up close, but good at range. I'm sure, like that comes up buildings. What would this be? Aren't these warehouses? What's that? Oh, it's somebody alive. Not a posed skeleton. Hello there. to a complete stranger? I suppose it's because I don't like to judge people until I get to know them. Sorry if I caught you off guard. The name's Evan. I've been out here for years now. I guess you could say that I like the peace and quiet. And the view. Well, look for yourself. It's something else. All Since I see is fog and rain. Me, I think you just return the favor. Need any supplies? Supplies? Sure. A couple dozen mini nukes would be the trick. <laughs> no? No. I'm afraid that's a bit beyond my reach. Let me see what I have. Here you go. I found this on the outskirts of Nuka World a while back. It isn't doing me any good. Give me some. Oh. Nuka Love recipe. <sighs> well, it's been nice having a visitor. Feel free to stay for a while and help yourself to anything else I have laying around the place. Don't mind me. I'm just going to hang out around here and enjoy the view. Oh, okay. Nuka... Love Nuka... Nuka side. That's what I got before. What? What would it be? Nuka side, Nuka love. I gotta be able to make Nuka cola. Hey, you Can we trade a few things? Trade, right? <laughs> Absolutely. Oh. Uh, okay, well, I don't wanna... No, you're good. got going in here, huh? Fertilizer. Cooking stove. Oil. I don't want to take the guy's stuff. He's been friendly with me. So. I don't have anything to cook. To think about it. I guess I have to start picking up animal parts. Yeah. Oh, there's more people here. I didn't even see them. Hey there. Looking to trade? What do you have? A little bit of everything. A bunch of odds and ends we grabbed before we left, and whatever we could scavenge along the way. You're just scavengers. Sure. Sure thing. <sighs> Don't have much at all. I have a lot of stuff. But vegetable starch, that's an adhesive. I guess I could buy that from her. I remember back in the day when adhesives were the main junk I was looking for. You have all these different colors. None of them are useful for me. You don't even have any cram? I'm hoping if we put our minds to it, we can help turn this place around. If you work, you eat. Sorry, it's I'm not really as good at conversation. What makes you think that? Hey, you know what I call a good day? One that ends without an empty stomach. Pretty much. Wow, people of this world. Interested in trading now? All right. Oh yeah, I can only take so many, but I will take this wild. I'll take the dark too. All right, Evan. Thanks. It's been fun. That was not even the what I was looking for. Let's see, we're going west now. Evans home, Commonwealth. That's probably the Hippologist camp that I'm looking for. Can we have nice weather, please? I am the overseer. I command it. Nice weather. 
This weather sucks. Careful. Oh, we've got eight PCs over there. Oop, I did not mean to do that, but... Actually, that was a good thing. I woke up a bunch of ghouls. I hate it when they run right at you so fast like that. Good with the bad, I guess. You're not leaving here in one piece. You're not killing anyone. Well, this is how I got a lot of my wealth. Looting ghouls. Between cigarette packs and don't leave anything behind. Uh, well, also I'm okay. looking for viable specimens, right? Got another one coming. Oh, one of those disgusting ones. Nice. What's some more? All I wanted was the splatter. Okay. Roger that right. one. Newly feral ghoul, yep. it looks like. Thanks for the advice. Rotten, not touching that. Bunch of soldiers died here. Wonder how. Plasma grenades. Pre war money. To survive so many years. Ammunition. It's pretty amazing. What about it? Yeah. Is that gunfire going off? Stupid storm. I can't hear properly. Pre-war money. Still trying to get to this. No, is it to the north now? <laughs> okay. Maybe the APCs were sent here to secure the area after the bombs fell. I mean, I guess the military was still functioning for a while. Wouldn't know, this is not much... Not many people remember. There's a few ghouls around. Not many people were around that in those times, and I wasn't one of them. I think we found it, Pip-Boy says we have. Radix, stim pack. I wonder if those actually save people when the bomb fell. No shortage of suffering to come, Will. Makes life easy. That's right. No shortage of suckers, huh? That's how you see things. How about shortage of people trying to survive and let's do what we can to help? No, you want to take what little these people who are trying to survive have. That's what an evil person does, Gage. Are you evil? The sign says open. Oh. Who are you? Are you one of the Hobologists? Welcome, stranger. We are Hobologists. Oh, you are? You may have heard of us. Yeah? No? Don't know anything about you, though. Well, if you've come seeking answers to life's great questions, Hobology has them. While I sincerely hope you'll join us, even if you don't, you want me to join you? Of a person of action. Hubology? What is that? Before the Great War, a brilliant writer named Dick Hubble invented a process for expanding the human mind. Through the process of alignment, he was able to give his followers great mental powers. I am his direct descendant and keeper of all his secrets, collectively known as Hubology. If you are really interested in joining us, 
go speak to Phil about having an alignment. We can help you find inner peace and inner happiness. Inner peace and happiness. We can help you master the amazing powers of the mind. What's this alignment thing you're talking about? Is this some kind of cult? Wait, I do remember that author. You're a bunch of religious kooks. How sad that you aren't open to learning the obvious truths of herbology. But I don't need you to be a believer. I need you to get me five spacesuits from the Vault Tech display in the Galactic Zone. Uh, I'll pay you 200 caps if you do. You should give me 200 each. What do you need spacesuits for? I suppose there is no harm in telling you. They will protect us in the battle to come. Battle? Huh. I'll need more than that for this job. Okay. I'll give you 250 caps. Uh, still not enough. Driving a hard bargain, I see. Okay. 300 caps. Hmm. I think you can afford more than that. Alright, but 350 is my final offer. Still not enough. Get me those suits. 500 would have been nice. Hey, Gage. This sure beat spending your whole life growing shitty crops just to wind up bullet. Yeah. Yeah, you just lose your humanity when you're killing and looting and murdering and pillaging. Okay. Sorry, I'd rather grow crops and be a raider. Well, there's more of them. Well, they did say hubologists. Huh? Well, never mind. Talk to me if you want an alignment. Yes, an alignment. You'll give me a you give me a free alignment? <clears throat> or you have to Are pay you for ready it. Ready to throw off the shackles of your neurodynes? My neurodynes. A small donation of 50 caps shows your commitment to self -care. You will take some rads during the procedure, so make sure you're healthy before starting. Uh Okay, tell me about this. What are neurodynes? Neurodynes are part of your brain. Part of your ability to think. After an alignment, you will think more clearly and be uh, happier. So neurodynes... Did you say... Stupid thunder! Should just gone... If I knew it would be like this, I just wouldn't remain a fist on mountain today. Can't hear a damn thing. Alright, so you said neurodynes cloud your brain? And alignment gets rid of it? Alignment? My back feels fine. Or is this not a chiropractic thing? Your central nervous system is pumped full of zeta radiation. This destroys some of the neurodynes. However, over time, they will build up again without further treatment. Ah, so you gotta constantly pay you guys to get rid of them. Isn't the first one supposed to be free? I suppose. Have a seat in the zeta align. Huh? Oh, no. I'm gonna get my neurodynes released. Where is it? Ooh, what do we got here? Nuka fruity recipe. All right, just have to find some means of being able to make Nuka Cola. Where do I go? Oh, sorry, it's right here. Let me start up. The How seat. are you doing? Hey, how's okay. it going? Well, I'm logging on to the world. Oh, there's so yes. many. What have you been doing? Good. Good. Bullshit. There's not even such things. Yes, it can hurt. Neurodyne. Done. For now. What do you want me to do about Congratulations. it? Congratulations. You are now an AHS. That stands for Aligned Help Seeker. We've taken the first step in a long journey. Here are your robes. My robes? You guys are really just kooks. This is a cult. If you need an alignment, you know where I'm to find surprised the raiders didn't yes. eliminate you guys. I, if I need an alignment. Excuse me. Hello, sir. Thanks for the radiation. Although it's not much more than eating cram, I guess. Don't take too long with those spacesuits. I'll get right on it. What are you looking at? Hey there. Don't take too uh. long with those spacesuits. Okay, okay. I'll okay. get right on it. Wow. It's a uh, crazy town here. There's more of them. Hey. I'm not gonna dress Hi. like you guys. <laughs> hey, how's it going? <clears throat> you look ridiculous. Yeah. You know what? Never mind. It's not important. Hi. 
Hey there. So I guess you guys had your alignments. Yes? Yes? Excuse me. Huh? huh. It doesn't matter. Alright. Spoken to the homologist. They, well, gave me a job. So I have no idea what's around here. There used to be a... Wasn't there like a means of transportation between the parks? Hmm. I have... There's no way I have blood meat. I've never even fought a blood worm. That is strange. But if I fight a, a blood worm, then I will. Okay, so I'll collect the meat. Um, get spacesuits. Where are the spacesuits? The uh, galactic one, right? Find the hidden cappies in galactic zone. And the spacesuit seems to be here. Well, I'm right here, so let's just wander down the road and see if we can't get in. I assume that from park to park will be the entrance, but... I mean, they made roads for a reason, so we should be able to still use it. To get in... Uh, where's the road? I'm not trudging through Radfield swamps. Not my thing. I've been aligned. I do remember that author. These this people have made a cult out of it. The car. Run. Tough little rat. Got a bunch of them. Want some more? Little things the size of a cat, but they bite. Are you guys gonna help? Are you looking for rad meat? Rad rat meat? I'm tired of the storm. Alright, so that's the park we want to get into. So keep going north. Let's see if I can't put. Um, I'm not sure. The entrance could be right here. They're, they have walls on the outside, right? Yes. Hey there. You had an entire uh, pack of mole rats looks like on it. your ass. Mole rats. Okay, so we'll just keep going until the road turns because well, if we don't, it's just gonna run have to run outside the walls, which is kinda pointless. So they have no life, it's the same. As it was back in the Commonwealth. No wildlife. Bloodworms, rad rats, and giant ants. Swarms of insects that we've had to fight too. What is this? Another. Oh my god. What is that? Where'd it go? I didn't even see what it was. What are you shooting at? Oh! Is that a spider? Well, they still have those. Get him! You need heavier firepower against these giant spiders. Right. Another spider? Sorry guys, I'm not seeing what you're shooting at. Let's hurry this up. Come on. 
Kind of wasting bullets, carry. All those bullets I've been saving up for you to have. Let's just keep going. Then. Whoa, what the? Is that giant grasshopper? Ugly thing. More of them coming. Attack! I'm not sure. Oh, thank you, mysterious stranger. Take him out. It's a lot of them. The car's gonna blow. Interesting. Somebody want these things meat? You know, we passed by this place over here, though. There was an entrance, I think, over here. Careful we don't slip. We don't know what lives here. It could be super mutants. It could be ghouls. Nuka World Junkyard. Another little, I wouldn't even call it a town, a village. There is something nearby. I that bear. Unknown. Oh, whoa! <clears throat> Coming at me, huh? One shot kill. What is on fire Up back yours. there? Whoa! Holy! It's not a rat storm that's going on. Nice, uh, statue. Or, not statue. Stuffed bear? <laughs> Why not let the robot do it? It's some taxidermist went to work and created that, but I, I don't know what you would call it. Choose. Uh, likeness one. There's no lineup of letters here. Crate. None. C. Yeah. Okay, it's not a C. So it's not can't be chosen then. Expose the O lines up. No, too many too much lines up. Likeness two. Um Is this the last one? Nope. Report. I'm through. Tektron control, huh? Uh, it says this is one unit's charging. Personality mode. Let's see. Law enforcement. I guess I just saw the one pod. Oh, monsieur. Most impressive. I ain't got the head for number, password, or whatever. More power to you. Okay. <laughs> it's got the little park thing going on top of its head. <laughs> okay. Uh, don't expect much from these old two bottle caps. There's a repair my power armor. I just have the impression that somebody lives out here. Guess not. Call me whacker. <laughs> Let's get this over. Okay, we got something. What are you firing at, Gage? What's up there? I hear, uh, Mr. Handy somewhere. Alright, let's go see what we can find. There's the stairs up here. Ah, 
take your fusion core. What's out here? Oh, another one of these. Up, and nobody's gonna stand in our way. Excellent. Now what's on the other side you're shooting at? Oh, there's a body here. Raider. Somebody took it out. I suppose. Another dead raider over there. I don't need to do it to myself with radiation. Let's move out. Yeah, I guess so. Was it this animatronic uh, alien you killed? Excellent. Oh. Targeting card vacuum head. I think it was being used as a turret. Not that I... Most impressive. Let's just open this up. I've got all the junk I need for a while for my power armor. Maybe I should have brought it with me. It's all dangerous that it is out here. I'm kind of wishing I did bring it with me. It is really dangerous. Right away, take this. This. Nice. Ooh, you a got magazine. Nimble fingers there, huh? Yeah. I have pretty Whatever. Much. Fear the Knife King. God. So obviously this is made post end of the world. Whatever you say. That ain't something you see every day. No. So ammunition. Literacy is important. But perhaps what is this? something of more substance Star is good for nurturing the mind. I wouldn't know about well, that. Power, power distributor? Smarts. Come to power. Maybe somebody it's will want not this. a big deal. Ooh, nuka Cola Dark. Uh, I gotta stop carrying these. I've already up a lot. I mean, how many bottles of Nuka Cola can one carry around? I'm not Buddy. Okay, we're still not in that park. We still don't get over the other side of here. There's more buildings this way. I call it a fever blossom, Gage says. Now what? Approach. Oh! Is that the one that I... Oh! Whoa! What the... I did not want to get hit by that. That is really powerful. But, take this. Another one's around here. Take ammunition. Yes. More ammunition and a safe. Safes are usually very easy to crack. Nice. Hell yeah. Where is it? Heard it. Area secure. There's radi um, nuclear waste barrels all down there. Not a place I really want to go through. Okay, daylight's burning. I love my... Um, whatchamacallit? Goss rifle, but... I only have so much ammunition. If I use it for everything, I'll be out. Save it for the dangerous things. Okay, here's where we killed those giant crickets. Um, where are we? Keep going north, turn right here at the... In case I can't see it for some reason. Crappy day. Started out nice for the first few hours. Is that a death claw? Looks like one. Well, I'll be damned. Let's get this it's show. Blue. Is it like a quantum death claw? All right. Well, here we go. Nice. Ah. 
My pleasure. Hell yeah. I hope you're right. Blue Deathclaw, huh? There's a safe in here. Difficult lock. I almost had it too. Oh. There we go. Another one. How come you didn't know I killed your mate, your friend? Done for now. I know you guys had death claws out here too. I'll take their meat. Mine now. Even take their hide. Maybe. Anything valuable or at least useful? Why do you ask? The hide is good leather. The meat is actually tastes like um chicken. Whatever. It tastes like alligator too, which I've had before. Bingo. Which tastes just like chicken. Okay, so did we reach it? We're close to the park. Still not there. We need to go north. This is little not even little. <laughs> Bus stops take you all over the place, I guess. It's not one of them. Weird looking thing too. Brain fungus. Oh, you find those inside, like in dark, dank places like caves. That's a turret. I don't know whose side it's on. Let's do this. We got super mutants. Let's find it then. Is that what's in this park? I see one. One. Got here, Raiders versus Supermans. Normally, I'd shoot both sides. Take him out. It's a tough looking one. Was. Lost control. Gauss rifle trumps everything. Bad, I guess. Oh, it's one of the disciples. Sweet. I was was it the disciples? I was supposed to go out to some spot. You know what? No more regular Nuka Colas. We have a lot. Okay, so what was I supposed to do? Uh, good defense. Rendezvous with team. That's my custom destination. Where was I supposed to rendezvous with the team? Oh, that's on the other side, back in the Commonwealth. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna do that. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Gage, hey, what are these Gage. people doing here? Are we going to get moving soon? Hey, hey there. Hey. Killing beats stealing any day. Nothing beats that rush. No <laughs> argument here. Psychos. Hey, I hate being pushed. Locker.
sweet. I never had the hands for that kind of shit. I'm glad you did. Don't worry about it. Oh wait. You did this? Are we there yet? That's right. We're going west now? Oh, okay, no. <laughs> um, I'm guessing right here. Need to turn around. About face this way. Which is oh, okay. There's so many things up in my pit boy. Passing by one in the park, Dry Rock Gulch, Galactic Zone. I guess we're sleeping in Galactic Zone. It's getting pretty dark. Man, I left early. This got up at like 6 in the morning. Fever Blossom. The thing that was with my light is just getting dark. Oh, Silphines, we have these all over the Commonwealth. Okay, so this is more of an impressive map, but it doesn't list anything, it just shows a picture of everything. Oh, is this the kitty one? It's too close. I'm guessing it is because everything's small. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm pretty sure there's seven in total. The seventh one is. But we're right here before the galactic zone. So let's go in. I have no idea what's in here. If, oh! She's dead. What? What is that? Oh, Sultron. Have you found something interesting? Not yeah. really. No. Keepers, am I right? Yes. The aluminum is good. Hey, Gage. The way I see it, either you wind up getting shot. Attention, space pilots. Earth is under attack, and you could be our uh -huh. only hope for survival. Is this still going to play the entire time we're here? At Nuka Galaxy. Okay, she's got a log on her. Tiana's log says. Welcome, Tiana. Please select an entrance. You got two entries in here. This is from last. This is before I even came out. You know, it's 22. What is it? May of 2288. Almost two years ago. Or it's over two years ago. Dad said we're heading out to the Galactic Zone again tomorrow. Still not sure how I feel about these salvage runs. It's amazing to see how much of the old tech still works. I wish I could stay and study it all, but Dad's crew is just there to rip it apart and haul it back for scrap. As if the world didn't have enough rusted metal and broken circuit boards already. At least I only have to take half shifts. I'm looking forward to Tonight getting back to my work on Star Control. I just hope we'll the old mainframe is still running. These do not sound like raiders. Not I don't think they are. S scavengers? Scavers? It's all my fault. It's, what is this? A week later? I told him. I told him there weren't enough cores left to turn it on. If he had waited an hour, we could have pulled them from around the zone, gotten Star Control back up and running. I already had people looking. I could have made it work, but he wouldn't listen. He wouldn't listen, and now, God, I hope he's alright. I can hear the screams. We're going to wait for nightfall, then make a run for the gate. Sorry, Tiana. I doubt your dad's alive. It's been quite a while. These things are not pushovers. Paris. Try a Nuka Cola Dark. Same great cola taste with an alcohol twist. Okay, you got me, even though somebody's shooting at us. Um, Nuka Cola Dark. Could use it. How many did I pick up? Victory. Where's the dark? It's not. It's warm, but it's still carbonated. It's alright. Can't taste the alcohol. Not killing anyone. That powerful sugary fizziness took over the taste. What is that? Attention, guests. If you've lost your hidden Statue. capsule glasses, 
Additional pairs can be purchased from any souvenir stand in any of our parks. I forgot about that. Okay, so... Should be two here in this park. I'm supposed to liberate it, and the spacesuits are at the end. Let's get rid of this. Actually, uh, let's remove it. This is one of my favorite ones. This is the one most, most popular park. Approach and identify yourself. Law abiding citizens. Not again. I'll save these for these tough things. You guys want to shoot these things, That's please? It. Check drones are really weak. Let's do this. Oh. Are you sure? I see it. Want some more? Uh-huh. Fortunately, with this light on, I'm lit up. Easy to see. I think there's more here. I can hear them. Ah, uh, Nuka Galaxy. Let's pay that time. Okay, let's line up. Get in the two hour lineup for this ride. Okay, why am I even going up here? The rides aren't working anyway. Plasma. Shooting plasma at me now. Two hour lineup. Just have to go on this once. Whoa. Oh! It's still kind of working. I don't want to be on this thing. This is really actually terrifying. It's not going to stop, is it? Ouch, ouch, ouch. I made a mistake. Uh, jumping off there don't seem like the smartest decision. It okay, let's not do that again. These things happen up here. You okay? Yeah. Pretty bad. I'm fine now. Let's not do that again. Because they're very unsafe. That's just a little weird and creepy. Oh, somebody made it in here. Traitor. That's the slaves around here. No, not really. I can't really say. Pretty much. Okay. So yes. everything that's to the south. I'm gonna make a pass. This is where we came in. Freshman's Nuka Galaxy Battle Zone. Exit. Star Control. We're in for a fight. I guess we'll find out. Oop. Let's get on with it. Pulling up my pit boys, I can help. I see you. I'm the last human you're ever. Well, this one's full of robots. It's still a Mr. Handy around here. Starport Nuka. What's with the iBots?
typically don't get attacked just by iBots. Are you serious? Yeah. Kill! Another one. Oh, watch out! Jeez, what's with the radiation? Looks like it. Let's just get this over with. Nuka cherries. <laughs> you can't stop me. I'm done. Cage, that is no way to fight. It's a turret. Yeah, we got ooh, power armor. We got the whole park interested in us now. You get in here. Lock gate. I wanna see what's in that power armor room. Looks like experimental. That's it. Mm-hmm. Another dead Nobody traitor. From you. Are they boss? No, nothing. Bingo. Need to pick that gun up. You can have your gun back. What did I take from you? Pipe break. Useless. Let's find out why. Ah, so people were. This sounds good. People were staying here. Sweet. Got to made a little uh, living space for themselves. Another magazine. Nice. Scav. I got. Issue one and two now. What is this? The terrible truce. This is the uh, Raider Gang. Truce. That Coulter had kind of created. Guess I'll take it. <laughs> Most folks I know can't even read. Which is very sad. I'll probably just look at the pictures. Yeah, you know, I've noticed a lot of people very cannot read. Refreshing person to travel with. What is this? Another one of the Star Horse. That sounds like a super mutant. Attack! Right. Go fuck yourself, you crazy robot. You're going down. I think we're done for now. Maybe not. Maybe a gr porter just grunted. Now these have all been activated. Okay, so here's another one. Today have a problem. Asshole. Did not expect that. Ooh, the radiation. Oh. Okay, that's bad. I'm gonna take right away. Never been around that much of the radiation hit. Oh. This is not good for the body. Makes me feel very weak. Nuka Cola lunchbox. Have you found something interesting? Possibly. Kind of miss Cosworth. Say the word. Okay. I don't like hearing him say these things though. It's the same voice. Okay, still haven't gotten in there. Maybe you get up down there from above. Excellent. They're on to us. Kill him. Let's 
Let's get out of here. Kurtz. What is that? Oh. There's an awful amount of robots. Nuka Cola Quantum Victory. I'm kind of at my limit for taking these things. Undamaged. What luck. Yeah, pretty much. T-51 it's helmet? It's probably worth a fortune. Was this like a bit of a museum? Can we go down? Power's out. Please be stairs down. Or up and down, whichever. Just let me go down. Got it. Oof, that sound. Well, I guess I'm not going down. Galactic Zone Manager's key. Turn me around. Manager's terminal. Uh, outbound communication. This is interesting. To Peyton Huxley, executive assistant to Mr. Brad Burton. That's the guy who created. Nuka Cola? Where's the park? This is pending over at Starport Nuka. We're experiencing all sorts of minor control malfunctions with the older model robots in the Galactic Zone. I'm sending over some of the incident reports. Nothing serious yet, but if Star Control ever loses its connection with these robots, I'm not sure what they'll do. Personally, I think our hardware is too far behind the software to have Star Control run the whole show right now. I know you don't want to hear it, but we really need to shut down the Galactic Zone and do a major overhaul before we have a ca catastrophic failure. That sounds pretty serious. Another outbound communication. Uh, to the CEO again. This is pending over Starport Nuka. Sorry to have disturbed you directly, Mr. Brad Burton, but we have a bit of a crisis on our hands over here. I'm certain your assistant can fill you in on the details if he hasn't already. I realize that Project Cobalt has put a lot of our resources on hold, but if we don't get some help soon, this could get out of control. Star Control was never meant to handle this many robots at one time, and we keep being asked to add more and older models to system. Please approve my requisition for new staff and maintenance requests as soon as possible. Explain why there's so many robots here. Inbound communication from Ingrid Suvenstein, Starport Nuka Technician. Ryan, that's my name. Ryan, Mark, want, Mark and I are tired of fixing these robots and getting them to play nice with Star Control. The new system has put a strain on their control modules and some of the older model, models can't just can't take the extra load. We're behind schedule as it is and now you want us to chaperone tour groups through Star Control? If you want this stuff fixed quicker you need to hire more staff or get to the bottom of why our purchase orders keep getting held up. That's odd. Last inbound, Mark Reisman, Starport Nuka Technician. Look, petting I'm about one day away from quitting if you don't get us some real help around here. I've got six units offline again today, and fixing each one takes almost our entire shift. Ingrid and I have been putting in 60-hour weeks just to keep things from falling apart around here. Look, get it together or I'm walking. Well, I don't know what happened in the end. Oh. There's a lot of tickets. Oh. Hey there. Oh, oh, I don't even have to go back. Thank you. I just picked up 950. That's worth a lot. I don't have to go back and play those stupid games there. Although with my shotgun, I can easily take everything out from the, the shooting gallery thing. Hot dog. Oh, I haven't had hot dog in since... Before I went to... The vault. Excuse me. Hmm. Intruder. I think it's Oh, really? It's just a well, it's a specific salty slab of meat put on a bun with mustard. 
Uh, I suppose you could recreate that, but the actual meat taste is probably not the easiest thing to... What are we going to use? I can spoil it for a fight. There's no pigs out that I've seen, just brahmin. Chick rad chickens. Not the same. I don't think this is a very good gun. It's not effective anymore. It used to be really effective against everything, but... Especially raiders. The two-shot LK I might replace. Maybe I should give it to Gage. Yep, it's sober. Uh, I just don't have the ammo, though. He would chew through it real fast. This, uh, the sniper rifle is really good. But the two-shot LK, which is my automatic weapon. More tickets, the nuke, nuke tickets. I think I'm, I might get rid of that gun. Okay, so... It says that they're down. Get back down. Where we go, there's robots shooting at us here. Okay, now it says it's up. Oh, make up your mind. Oh, this thing. Okay. It's. I must be close by, and that's why I need to pay attention. So we're gonna go to get the spacesuits. And that's up. So we'll go back up. The problem is trying to find these... That's why I'm wearing these stupid glasses. I'm not wearing it because I think it looks good. It still says it's up. Now it's showing the, the... Those things are down. Huh. What's over this way, Kiri? You are so beautiful. No matter how extreme the odds, together I think we will overcome. Yes. Most definitely. Have you found something interesting? Maybe. Did not you find what I wanted. If you can help it. Okay. Oh, whatever. Okay, so I've got to look on... It's close by. It's like to the right. Right by the Starport Nuka. Well, we are in Starport Nuka. No, it's the Galactic Zone. Starport Nuka's a ride. Uh, to the right. So it says this is down? Is that even possible? I thought that was some kind of growth, but no, these are the, I guess, the asteroids to make it seem like it's in space. <laughs> You're in space now. Oh, see? Gone. I can't mark around it. It's too close on the pit boy to the other something else. Find the hidden cappy cappy zone. I got the glasses on. Eliminating Ow. That really hurt. <laughs> A little more challenging next time. Oh. <sighs> this is taking a lot out of me. Oh, oh, that's bullshit. Thirty years old, going on dead. Nuka Cola Come Wild. To Papa. You have my honor oh, shut up, Codsworth. I see you. You're off to the scrap heap. I'm not promising anything, but I'll All think right. about it. Okay, so we were looking for it. If it doesn't stop moving. Ah, oh, it is. It's off the pit boy again. However, oh, it should be right ahead. Look on the walls. All I need is one letter or whatever it is. We were here, too. Yes. You are very good, you 
the body pin. Yes, I am. I never had the hands for that kind of shit. Glad you did. Don't worry about Wait, it. We were here, right? Or maybe we weren't. I don't know. What's that humming? Pretty sure we were here. Hey, look on the walls. There it is. Two clues down. Eight to go. A G and an S. Why do you guys talk to yourselves? How could that possibly be beneficial? Oh, Can't stop me. I think I've been Please tell me we're done. Usually cam come in pairs, these laser turrets. Okay, so where's the other one? Behind us, but we're close to get the spacesuits. Safe right here. There's safes everywhere out here. If you say so. It's probably worth a fortune. Hey, this is where we're supposed to go in. We'll try to get that other happy thing once we get out. Now, what's this place going to be like? This place is all about vault -Tec. And their vault. What could go wrong? vault -Tec. There's their <laughs> vault to the future right there. Let's see what this says. Sales instructions. Hello, vault -Tec sales associate. As people exit the vault -Tec, among the stars exhibit, you'll be responsible for taking visitors aside and converting them to potential applicants, even if they seem interested. Remember that the applicant will have many questions, but very little time on their hands. How can you ensure that they're prepared to step through our sales process in a quick and accurate manner? Simple. Remember the three I's. Introduction, initiation, and information. Note, if any of the applicants appear to be ill or acting in a strange manner, be certain to report this to a sales supervisor immediately. Step 1. Introduction. First and foremost, greet the applicant with a hearty handshake and a warm smile. Perhaps tell a light, clean joke to make them laugh or a pleasant compliment about their appearance. Ask them if they want something or to drink or offer them a snack. Check how they're feeling and gauge their mood. Make them feel like they've already, they're already home and a part of the vault -Tec family. A steady show beginning with this approach increases the chances of a sale by over 20, 28%. Step 2. Initiation. When you feel like you've gained their confidence, explain the benefits of life within a vault using the information from our Better Living Underground packet. If they still appear hesitant, don't pester them or give them the hard sell. Our studies show that this over-aggressive approach usually turns the applicants off and they become unwilling to listen to anything you have to say. For the overly skeptical applicant, or if you need something to tip the scales if you think the applicant is undecided, we suggest letting them glance through the history of radiation burns. <laughs> or the mutations. It could happen to you, brochures. Oh my gosh. Step 3, integration. So, you finally convinced the applicant to sign? Good job. Now it's time to step through the quick and painless application process. Pull the following forms from the new applicant's file. GZ089 Health Form. TR17 Liability Waiver, LM222 Last Will and Testament Form, <laughs> DB104 Vault Tech Citizenship Agreement, XM003 Organ Donation Invoice, WH660 Psychological Evaluation Screening, KY269 Intimate Relations Conduct Agreement, PLK575 Rights Revocation Charter, and the FQS010 Family History Form. Have the applicant fill these out in quint quintuplicate. Yeah, you'd be here for an hour filling that out, if not more. File the daffodil colored copy in the. Yeah, well, you wouldn't have to. They just have to do once because there's other pages underneath the thing they're signing or filling out. File the daffodil colored copy in the corporate bin. File the lemon colored copy in the local bin. 
Place the canary colored copy in the medical pin. Place the gold colored copy in the insurance bin. And present the yellow copy to the applicant. Do not place the wrong copy in the wrong bins. Or the process will need to be repeated. What is canary color as opposed to yellow? Because I thought it was just yellow. Guess I don't know my forms. I'm not an office worker. Going down. It's locked. Okay, so this is just one big sales pitch. I don't remember them trying to sell me. I know they were talking about vaults, but not kind of sweet. This looks like it's going to a vault. Oh, got an assault on Whoa! That thing. Oh my god. That's crazy. It was at me, lightning fast, and. Oh, Lee. Like I give a shit. That is deadly. Yes. If I had taken one more second, I could have been killed. Uh huh. Have you found something in Even half a second. It's nothing special. <sighs> Sweet. Lots of ammunition. Excellent. Oh, man, my heart's racing. That happened way too fast. That's actually one of the deadliest things I've ever encountered. And I have fought a lot of things in the last. Whatever, 10 months? Seven months. Seven, no. Yeah, seven months. Mine's a little frazzled after that. Okay, come on. I know you're a difficult lock, but... <sighs> Whew. Heart's don't pounding don't there. Pushing too many buttons. Who knows what'll happen? I'll keep that in mind. Gage, do you know what I've been through in the last seven months? I think we'll be fine. Vault Tech employee key. That could help. Mine now. Operations terminal. So this is a Vault Tech within Nuka World, okay? J. Hodgson, Operations Engineer. Journal entry. So. I'm trying to figure out what this means. Uh, 77, I take it. It's 2077, but what's the. 016, so January 16th, February 19th, April 20th, April 23rd, and May 30th. Okay. It's my first day on the job here at Vault Tech Exhibit. Never thought they'd let you work in Nuka World. I mean, you can hardly call this a job. All I have to do is make sure the exhibit doesn't fall apart, all the techs are happy, and sometimes conduct a tour or two. Plus, I'm getting paid double what I made at the Washington, D.C. office. One of the guys working at Nuka Galaxy said they gave give rides to the employees after the park closes, so I'll probably head over there after work and check it out. Which was very wrong against company policy. I had a scare when this old guy collapsed after walking through the exhibit. I thought he might have had a heart attack. <laughs> but Dr. Bateman said that it was just a heat stroke. Uh, I thought that was weird excuse because we keep the exhibit at a constant 72 degrees. And that's too hot for old folks. <laughs> I'll bring it up in the next staff meeting. Journal entry from April. Another really strange day. Dr. Bateman locked himself out of the observation room again. I told him to put a spare key in his locker so he wouldn't forget it next time. He brushed me off and left the room. I don't know why, but the whole interaction made me really, really angry. A few minutes later, I had a bad headache. Maybe something's wrong with the filtered air system in the exhibit? What the hell is going on around here? I don't know if someone is messing with my terminal or if I'm losing my mind. I don't remember making that last journal entry about getting angry or having a headache. I felt perfectly fine for weeks. Just a few minutes ago, Dr. Bateman came through and out of nowhere he said I should really stop drinking on the job. What? I do smell a little bit like whiskey but I don't remember drinking any. Maybe I need a vacation or a doctor's appointment. Wow, that would be very disturbing if that was happening to you. To me, I should say. All right, I've had enough of this. The lady just went nuts and ran out of the exhibit screaming. The day before that, some guy took off all his clothes for no reason and acted like he didn't have a care in the world until security dragged him away. To make matters worse, I keep getting sudden nosebleeds and headaches. I'm constantly forgetting things I've done and misplacing stuff I shouldn't be losing. Dr. Bateman said he thinks it has something to do with stress or new job anxiety, but come on, nosebleeds and memory loss from job anxiety, really? Maybe they, uh, they had a contract with Hallucigen and are flooding the place full of chemicals. Yeah, 
this is fine. I wasn't planning to start core tonight anyway. Understandable. What is this? Okay, we got daily observation. This sounds like another vault tech experiment that's going on here. Did anybody ever actually come and stay in this vault? You see an assaultron, you shoot, shoot first and ask questions later. Ooh, another key. I think that they were doing some kind of Bingo. shitty research. Another one right here. I think we're done for now. Oof, that hurt. <sighs> Come back and read that thing in a moment. Just want to see where this goes. Are we in the vault? Hostile target. Not again. Sweet. Have you sustained injuries? Bye. Where you can relax in an earth like setting. Hey, eyes up. Oh, out there. Let's find it then. I saw it. It's behind that. Ooh, another one. Good riddance. Where are you? This has got to stop. How about something a little more challenging next time? See it. You're up. It. Oh, that. this will be hard. Got it. Looks like it. Glad that's over. Well, I'm just curious. Uh, I think we've entered part of the vault. This is really strange. It totally. These are vault type rooms. So, let's see what the experiment 004 observation terminal says. <laughs> 